I have this network set up in my basement. However, you may have noticed I'm using an old router to do all the hard work. Why do I have all of this equipment only to be using an old router to distribute internet throughout my home? Well, my philosophy is if it ain't broke, don't try to fix it. And for most lab environments, I use virtual machines located in the servers below right here when I'm turn them on. And if I need a virtual router, I can spin it up, for example, PFSense firewall, which is router firewall combination and do all my work. But for general home network distribution, I'm using a general purpose router that has been in use for more than five plus years. Until this router breaks or runs out of features that I really need, I will keep using it because there is no need to spend money on something that is not needed. This router can handle one gig of data distribution throughout my network and there's no need for me to replace it. So this is my expensive home lab with a really cheap old router that is in place of a specified uh, enterprise network router. So there is no network router that is uh, enterprise grade here. But however, if I want one, I can simply spin that virtual machine with virtual routers and firewalls. So why am I showing you this? Because a lot of new home labbers spend a lot of money to learn network engineering and network concepts by adding every equipment onto your server rack in one go. But there is no need for it. Even I am using an old router for now because I don't need a new router and I don't need to spend that money at this moment.